so guys as you can see i've been done with my hair wash day and this is what i've come up with i've come up with the protective hair is under this and yeah so this is um a day a night after my hair wash day okay and treatment day deep conditioning day and i am at a friend's graduation party i'm at a friend's graduation party so I just want to bring you along briefly so you guys know how my look how do I look how do I look have my glasses here guys you know guys you know I have a second eye right how do I look okay so that is it um if you find you can give it a try and see if it's helpful for you let me know if it has been if it's not like I said, I've been doing this for the past four months and it has been very, very helpful. You know, my hair has thinned out a lot and that's why I like to keep my hair short. But the pressure to keep it, to grow it back has been on from my boys and then also friends don't like seeing it short. Not that I care. But I just figured let me keep it up for a little bit let me grow it back up and let me see if there is a change so I'll keep you guys posted let me know if you like this video give it a thumbs up and share with your friends kindly subscribe um, turn on your notification hello Apple lovers how is everybody doing it's been a minute guys i miss you all hey okay guys today i'm going to do this and i thought it's been a while since i brought you a content so let me do this so you see what i do to do my to treat my hair my hair treatment i cut my hair a few months ago you know um august 27th to be precise last year and really, I don't have any plan of redoing my hair. I haven't been doing my hair for a while. But I thought, hey, let me keep it. Let me grow it back up. So this is what I've been doing. Do another treatment. I'm like, why not show you guys what I do? What I do. So this is the treatment I use. So watch the entire video, okay guys? Watch the entire video. And you will see and understand it better. This is the aloe vera. This is avocado. This is onion. This is uh, banana. This is my soaked rice. This is fenugreek seed, rose petal, lavender flower, rosemary leaves, okay? And I use this for my oil. And I didn't want to trash it, so I saved it up so I can use it to do my deep conditioning treatment. And actually, this has been in the, I saved it up in the fridge, so it's been there for a while a few months maybe two three two months at least now since the last time i did a video well yeah i believe so i'm gonna use this i'm gonna blend it up with the rice and part of this part of that i'm gonna use all the aloe vera because i'm gonna save some when i i'm gonna do it a lot and i'm gonna say what i do is i do the treatment a lot then i save it up in the fridge right or freezer freezer that's where i do it usually i save it up in the freezer and then when i'm ready to use it again i bring it up and tore it and then use it that's what 
you see me doing today okay so i'm just gonna i'm just showing you the introduction so you see what's gonna be and then after that i will see you guys when i apply it in my hair okay see why i use both to strain it look at all that so if you apply the aloe vera directly to your hair all these things will be on it you know so that's why i use the double straining method all right and this avocado is not as ripe as i would want it I didn't buy it on time. I just bought it today. I didn't plan ahead of time. If I did, the banana would have been softer than it is and this too would have been much ripe than it is. I wish it's a little ripe, but it's, it looks, it feels fine. Look, I like it. It's healthy and it's organic. The banana too is organic, guys. So I have the onion, banana, and avocado in there. And fenugreek seed. See the uh, aloe vera. I saved some. I wanted to use all, but it's not too much. So I'm saving some. I'm actually going to blend it now, and I'm going to add it to this and save it. So, as you can see, I have my aloe vera here. I have my avocado here. I have my banana, my onion my moringa powder the fenugreek powder i'm not gonna use i'm gonna use this right here this already have the most i have my soaked rice out here i soaked it since morning so i'm going to add it now and then after i finish blending and apply it to my hair i leave it for a few hours sometimes overnight but today it doesn't look like it's early in the evening so i'm not gonna leave it on overnight so before i go to bed i'm going to wash it out after i wash it out i'm going to use the canton shampoo to shampoo it out after shampooing then i will apply the deep conditioner again the treatment i'm preparing again after i finish shampooing my hair and that one will be left in for also a few hours an hour or two after that i will just wash it out at that point my hair is clean my scalp is clean so i don't like to wash wash it again with shampoo no i wash it all out and then the canton shea butter um hair conditioner i'm gonna use that to rub in my hair for a few minutes you know let, let maybe 10 15 minutes to let be able to comb my hair out and after combing it out i will now rinse it i don't rinse it all out like oh i'm doing extreme cleansing no because i want the treatment to remain in my hair right okay so after that i will use the oil the oil i have prepared out of this that i showed to you in the previous video i will come uh, Put that link in the comment section in the dis uh, yeah discussion section of this video if you want you are interested in looking at the ingredients so i'm gonna put that that's pretty much all i use for my hair i don't use any other pomade lotion no that's it so i'm gonna use that and i'm gonna show you the 
outcome i just put my hair in simple twist by myself or just a protective kind of hairstyle that i can put my wig on or i tie my hair lately a lot and i'll just show it to you all right see you soon so guys this is the one i'm going to save in the fridge in the freezer actually and so a few weeks from now if i want to do another treatment or hair care day then i'll bring it out and do what you uh, tore it then i use it this is a leftover of the um aloe vera juice so i'm going to also put that in the container and put keep that also in the freezer whenever i'm ready to use it again voila i have it and i use it yeah right now i'm just gonna show you how i did my hair right so you see i have this now all wrapped up so i have it all wrapped up and what i'm gonna do is tie it so that it will be contained the heat will be contained it's about 6 8 p.m right now so i will wash it out so then i tie it again to keep the heat in it sometimes i use a thicker fabric to tie it out so in the next two three hours i'm going to wash this out and then shampoo it with the cantoon hair shampoo and after that i will add a second layer of the you know the second um deep conditioning treatment i told you the same thing but i'm gonna i do it twice so this is on the dirty hair that is not clean so after two three hours i'm gonna wash it out shampoo the hair and then i'm ready for my final treatment so i put the second treatment on leave that also for a few hours and then when i rinse that one out i'll use the cantoon hair um conditioner at that point leave it in for 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse it out after that i'm ready to put in my protective hair braids or twist so stay tuned So guys this is the first after the first few hours so I'm gonna go and wash it now with the cantoon shampoo okay all right So this is the second round, see the hair, so this is the second, yeah, so this, this is the second round of the treatment, and this is the one that I'm going to allow to sit in it. I'm not going to entirely wash it. I'll wash it all out 
but I will not shampoo it or deep condition it to uh, condition it to be so long. I'll just wash the dirt out, but not the, you know, and try and leave the. Don't be alarmed. It has aloe vera, which is good for the skin. It has um, the avocado. It has all this good stuff, for, which is which are good for the skin. So when I do it, sometimes I apply it to my face also like this, like a mask. Because at the end of the hair care I also do my skincare routine my whole body soak and all my relaxation therapy as I call it so because I use the bullet you see the rice the rice is not all that smooth but don't worry, when I wash my hair, usually I have a way of doing it all that's come out easily. So you see, I have the plastic on my hair and then I have the rag also, the scarf so to keep the treatment warm, heat contained and after a little bit this is so this is the second deep conditioning the first one like I said done with the dirty hair this is done with the clean hair and this will not be shampooed out I'll wash it really good but I will not shampoo it out so that the benefit of the deep conditioning is gained all right, so I'll see you guys very soon after I finish washing this one and I finish putting in my protective braids or twist. I'll show it to you. All right, watch, stay tuned. So you see, I have the Cantoon conditioner in now. I have the Cantu conditioner in. I'm going to wash it. So the second uh, round of the deep conditioner was done and was rinsed. It was rinsed without shampoo. So this is the Cantu conditioner that I use. See that? Akai Berry shampoo. Cantu Akai Berry shampoo. Revitalizing shampoo. And this is the Cantu Akai Berry Revitalizing Conditioner. So that's what is in my hair right now. I'm going to rinse that and I'm going to use the oil that I prepared. The oil I prepared from the with the olive oil, avocado oil, um, moringa powder, and fenugreek seed that's it there I also added rose rosemary leaf um, rose petals and lavender flowers and then after it was done I infused it with um, Jamaican black castor oil uh, peppermint oil rosemary oil of course hemp seed oil yeah and some few others so that's what i've been using after rinsing the conditioner 
out that's all i'm gonna be using i'm gonna be using the oil i don't use any other pomade this is it so i add this then i put i part my hair and put it in um um protective cornrows or protective twist and i put my wig on i haven't been to the salon <laughs> i just do it this way i mean it saves me money it prevents me i used to have a lot of tenderness under my scalp so i don't have to deal with that much because i don't go to the salon to have anybody touch my hair yes thanks for staying here with us if you have not subscribed yet up to this point kindly consider subscribing okay subscribe so guys as you can see i've been done with my hair wash day and this is what i've come up with i've come up with the protective hair is under this and yeah so this is um, a day a night after my hair wash day okay and treatment day deep conditioning day and I am at a friend's graduation party I'm at a friend's graduation party so I just want to bring you along briefly so you guys know how my look how do I look how do I look my glasses yeah guys you know guys you know I have a second eye right how do I look okay so that is it um if you find you can give it a try and see if it's helpful for you let me know if it has been if it's not like I said, I've been doing this for the past four months and it has been very, very helpful. You know, my hair has thinned out a lot and that's why I like to keep my hair short. But the pressure to keep it, to grow it back has been on from my boys and then also friends don't like seeing it short. Not that I care. But I just figured, let me keep it up for a little bit. Let me grow it back up and let me see if there is a change. So I'll keep you guys posted. Let me know if you like this video. Give us a thumbs up and share with your friends. Kindly subscribe. Um, turn on your notification. And guess what? Sooner or later, my boys will come on summer break. And when they do, I'm going to have more time to bring you more content. Thank you all for sticking along with me. Have a wonderful time. So we'll see you again right here on Epoch White. Bye.